ineligible player downfield. Offense, number 74. Had the 55 yarder to send the game into overtime. I mean, I think John is not the third man in the broadcast booth, but he's, it's as if he is. I feel like he's right next to him. <laughs> have you heard that before? Yes. You go, you go way back with Mr. Cruden. Yes. Yes, I have. And he's just, he's just loudly expressing his displeasure about the calls here that prevented his team from having an opportunity. And what I'd like to say to you, Mr. Down Judge, Mr. Frank LeBlanc, very simply is, I would like to speak with your referee, Mr. Jerome Bogle, so that I could make my case. That's exactly the way you expect him to play, taking on a inside linebacker, lowering his shoulder, and picking up yards after contact. Was Metcalf's mouthpiece. DK or, Metcalf. Or his, his pacifier <laughs> to keep him nice and calm. My apologies. There is no foul on the play. Result of the play is a first down. But when you have officials now <laughs> apologizing to a crowd, that's that's a classic. That, I tell you what, that's Son Hockley <laughs> has been all over it today. He, you know, he was raised earlier well in the dad, he, yes, he? He, yes, he was. And <laughs> the Hockley legend is alive. Look at the guns, just like Dad. Go to the fourth. And Cano's got another. Adding to that Giants record, 35 straight. I don't know what happened here with, with Gano. Look at some of the off the field style on both sides of the ball. And then uh, there's, again, there's uh, our old friend Rob Ryan on the Baltimore stamp <laughs> getting ready for next year's Met Gala. <laughs> And all of his buddies. There you go. Intentional grounding by the quarterback. He was out of the pocket, but the ball did not reach the line of scrimmage. This is a 10-yard penalty from the previous spot. It's a loss of down, and it requires a 10-second runoff. Game operator, game clock operator, please set the game clock to seven seconds, and the clock will start on my signal. 75 on the offense was injured on the play. By rule, this requires a timeout by New England. This timeout avoids the potential for a 10-second runoff. However, the intentional grounding is still in force, 10 yards from the previous spot, and a loss of down. The game clock should read 17 seconds, and will start on the snap. Thank you. It's an outstanding explanation that, of Sean what was a lot of twists and turns in that interpretation. Yeah, Sean Hockley <laughs> just nailed that. That was, uh, that was, that was terrific. And then he even said thank you at the end yes, of it. That was, did. yeah, that was, that was impressive. You know, I'm going to go in. You know, that dive, it's pretty ugly, but <laughs> it's effective. <laughs> Got the job done. Game of 14. Beautifully done. Flags are thrown. They went from their own two to San Francisco's six. And the penalty may move this back. 91 yard connection from Hertz to Watkins. Full start. Offense. The entire left side. Five yard penalty. Let's go first down. It's a great call by Brad Allen, the whole left side. I present to you Sherry Burris getting a job done at the fish market. Sherry, great catch yesterday. Guys, I got to tell you, I was so nervous, but they set me up for success. And James, maybe you can attest to this. I was supposed to really catch and bend at my knuckles to make sure that fish didn't fly through my hand. But hey, maybe I have a future in uh, catching fish at the market. What do you say? I think you need to get out on the field on third down. Oh, third and four. That. And it's broken up. Sherry would have had it. <laughs> He's rocking the blue hair because he says that during the ups and downs of a season, you have to stay cool headed. So <laughs> at this moment, he needs red hair. He's, uh, he's pretty angry on that sideline. By the way, Drew Brees, the only quarterback in history to average more passing yards per game than Matthew Stafford. How did you know that? You, you literally just, what did you, you're like a human encyclopedia, Kenny. <laughs> Our producer called you a human nerd. <laughs> he's not that far off. <laughs> this man's a magician. Now you see me, now you don't. Okay, Leonard Floyd has him dead to rights. And whoop. Next one. Oh, right under Sebastian Joseph Day. 
God, all that for five yards. <laughs> for one yard, excuse me. Makes a nice play, and man, I'm so jealous <laughs> of these celebrators. I wish we had a camera like this so I could do that when I play. I'm just going to hate on all defenders from here on out. Played about a decade too early. <laughs> Don't age me, Kenny. God. Hey, You've heard of Einstein's theory of relativity, correct? Man, now so, we're working in Einstein. Uh, I'm a little, I'm a physicist at but home, yes. though, just so we know. Okay, so here's what you substitute for. So energy equals mass times the speed of light squared, correct? So in football, it's not that. It's impact equals mass, not your weight, but how, how big you are, times your speed. And so you are add a little bit of Archimedes in there, which is a leverage guy, right? Give me a lever, I'll move the world. So that is how a 200 pound guy can deliver a blow because he's running faster into that impact and have that impact and still score. Thank you very much. Can we, Mr. Einstein will. <laughs> can we clip off that last minute and send it to Harvard, Yale, and all the Ivies? Because I just feel like. That's Millen's theory of relativity. <laughs> oh. He comes off the top now. He's. Well, he made the call, so I guess that's the rule. See, Allen, so you disagree. Allen was pointing to his helmet quickly. Yeah. Now I'm going to be an old curmudgeon and go, that, you can't even fart on guys anymore. They call a flag. <laughs> you got it Tolstoy earlier. Now we pass gas. Man, we got it all. <laughs> Just being real. <laughs> so here's Waddle. There it is. He has it. He fumbles it, right? Now, does he have control again? Right there. Well, uh, did he have it all the way through? That's a tough one. Mike? Might have had Michael, a case. are you out there? Bring me in voice. Uh, all right, paging Mike Pereira. What do you have, partner? Burrow. Just with tiptoe out of bounds, and then he gets nudged oh. down by Robert Quinn, and the Bengals are going to get a first down. Watch Joe play this perfectly. Joe set this up perfectly. Give him an Oscar. Watch, watch. He knows it keeps coming. Boom. Look at that. He knew that was coming. And that was Robert Quinn. Excuse me. But he stood right there and let him run into him. It gives a pretty good acting job. Give the guy an Oscar. Second long run of the night for Jared Goff. That's for 26. And he gets a, gets a pat from Aaron Rodgers. As Campbell told us, his mom said at an early age, you're either going to be a great leader or wind up in prison. <laughs> you want to get Lewis Riddick fired up. You talk to him about the corners not turning around to face the football. Hey, I'm telling you, it's something you hear on TV <laughs> all the time, right? I mean, you hear people say, well, he's got to turn around and look for the football. When you're running full speed, right. especially if you're trailing someone and you don't have control of them, it, it's not smart to turn your head and look for the football because what happens when you turn your head? Slow you, down. You slowed exactly. See, Steve, you're listening. Even I know you're that listening. one. Hold on, hold on. <laughs> hold on a second here. You're when listening you're, up here. When you're in phase and you got the speed oh. of a guy like that, you can turn around. Exactly. Yeah. When you're in phase. Yes. Yeah. Absolutely right. When, Absolutely you're, at, when right. you're out of phase, it's a whole, totally different story. That's right. Look you're at a phase right now, Steve. <laughs> Third and five. They didn't want me like that ex-girlfriend. Shoot, I got to go. But, you know... I got a rebound. It was the Lions. They picked me up. You know what I mean? Now they feed me good, taking me to dinners. You know what I mean? Another man's trash is another man's treasure. And the best part of that, they feed me good, take me to dinners. <laughs> <laughs> Trey Flowers, a guy to watch on the perimeter uh, in the run game for Detroit defensively. He is their captain and leader. And Ifatu Melifonwu. Yes, got that one right, Levy. Thank you. If a player stands up and in that quick reaction directs at his opponent, they do not want to talk to. They want to flag immediately to try to get this out of the game, guys. That was our no fun uncle giving us the call on the phone there once again. <laughs> ah, you're giving Gene a hard time. Gene was right on the money yeah. with that. Old Jordan Humphrey. I love the uh, I love the push-ups there by by J.C. Horn, knowing that he missed an interception. But we got to get that back a little bit flatter. Those were a little. I don't know if they were Chris Myers quality push-ups right there. <laughs> yeah, you know I, I, I what do I hit 50 or 75 every morning? <laughs> and you make sure you count them for me. But I you know I don't know if we have that video. Maybe we can show that before the game because J.C. Horn. <laughs> is, I mean, come on, we got to get, yeah, get a little flatter yeah, back. You're right, flatter you, back. right, straighten that out. That's not actually healthy. But he's on the field in his gear, so let's cut him some slack. That was a quick one. Oh, like only five minutes. 
no incomplete passes on either side. Yeah. That makes him want to throw up. <laughs> That's bad defense. <laughs> Quarterbacks, a combined 11 of 11. Hey, you shouldn't have told me that. <laughs> well, they are really, really good friends. In fact, this week they graced the cover of Sports Illustrated for kids. Look at these two guys. And their first season as teammates last year, they connected 127 times. And as I said, those 127 catches by Diggs led the NFL. And for more on this budding romance, let's go down to Sarah Kustak. Careful, BG, but <laughs> you said it. We see the magic on the field. There's an instant connection, but also off the field, best friends. And Josh told us, Stefan told me earlier today. The only turnover we hadn't today, haven't had today is an apple turnover. And we've had five <laughs> in the first half. Everything else, and you got fumbles, you got picks, you got you got all kinds of stuff. For the Bears, Bengals rookie Jamar Chase. Everybody talked about how he struggled with drops in the preseason. Last week, though, five catches, 101 yards, a touchdown, and no drops. His quarterback Joe Burrow had this to say to the media after the game. I thought he was dropping everything. <laughs> Hard hitting Pittsburgh and Raiders. Yeah, the Pittsburgh Steelers. Najee Harris to take this flat pass. He's going to go 25 yards with it. Pittsburgh cuts the lead from 16 to 14. It's getting a little chippy in uh, Pittsburgh. You know a little bit about that, don't you, Adam? Don't ask, Coach. <laughs> What I did to him playing cornhole against him this summer, okay? Not 